I, I miss them all intros. You know, like, this is JR here with Jerry King Lawler. Time to whoop that ass. Jim Ross here. On behalf of me and Jerry the King Lawler, we welcome you to the Windy City. Raw action in Chicago. The Raw superstars are going to blow the Windy City away tonight. I can't wait. I realize we have a difference of opinion on this, King. But I've got to say that I don't believe the outcome of this match is in doubt. And I think we're in for an upset tonight, JR. Aren't you the one who's always saying that anything can happen in the WWE? Stacy Keeper is not just a pretty face. Oh, she what? knows how to handle her business in the ring. Oh, I missed. Oh, wait, is every up button just that? I didn't know that. Oh, so every down thing is that, and then every up button is that. This better do like a bunch of damage or something. This main game is tedious. I told those ladies that I'm available for massages later if they're sore after this match. Nice. Oh. Well, that just happened. Just gonna win this right quick. Trish will do whatever it takes to win this matchup. Just like choke the shit. I'm just gonna choke the shit out of her. And when she passes out, like, technically just win. I mean, she'd really have to hurt me at this point. Or not. Oh, damn. I didn't know she could do that. All right. Oh, man, JR. I think the king has found his new queen. And now she's taunting her opponent. Wait, stop laughing. I can't move. I can't dodge when you're laughing. Oh, boy. Yeah, no. Ooh, wide open. Major look. Ooh, I wasn't ready for the slap. Yeah, get wet. I'm speechless, JR. Oh, wait. This is, this is just great. I wasn't trying to do that yet. Okay, so I can't do like an up down or a down down or a left down or a right down, but I also can't do a right. Um, so I, got, I can only do left and right. Let's see. She's showing a great deal of confidence by taking the time to taunt her opponent. Alright, you need to chill. Oh, I didn't know. Oh, naughty bit. What a kick from Stacy! She's got legs and she knows how to use them, JR. God damn, that was my finisher. How are you still conscious? I mean, for like a second. Man, I kicked your whole head off. Still in there somehow. Okay, so I can still do the chest slaps. And I still suck at them, it seems. Neither one of these divas is Demo. willing to give an inch. Yep. I had a joke there too. I was gonna say give an inch, take several, but I don't know, it seemed kind of inappropriate. She's wasting time taunting her when she should be putting her away. You know, there was something I've been wondering. I don't, how does my clean beater exactly, like, or my face beater, what exactly does that do when I max it? Because they, they don't ever really tell me. Ooh, just drop your ass. Let me see. Whoever loses this match has got to deal with the humiliation of being stripped to her underwear in front of thousands of fans. Can I just release you? No? Okay, well. 
Like, I'm, I'm just testing stuff out at this point. Sorry if it's like a bit weird, but I just want to. That could be it. God damn it. The top man finished. Alright, come here. I need you to sit down for a second. Almost there. The diva who winds up in her bra and panties might lose the match, but she's won my heart. She's showing a great deal of confidence by taking the time to taunt her opponent. Come on, I'm almost there. He just doesn't stay down. God damn, it's just bitches scary. Like, I know it's Trish and everything, but come on. Oh, I thought I was about to turn into another minigame. Wait, no, jump. Oof. Woohoo! Puppy power! This is great! This man just say puppy power. She's showing absolutely no respect to her opponent. That moving for a second. Almost there. Just a few more taunts. Yeah, you like getting throttled. Come on. One more. Almost. What does that even do? My hits deal more damage and my taunts quicker. Okay, that's about as close as I'm gonna get to actually finishing that fucking time. Okay, sit out. Try and keep your mind on the match, King, and your hands above the table. You know, when your charisma is pretty high, you, it's easy. Like, I, I guess my guy's stats are just too low that I can't do it, right? Although, I guess that doesn't really have to do the slapping game, does it? Well, that clean me doesn't do shit. I wonder shit. if any of the Maybe Divas would like to show them some holes. Why the fuck am I just here? I mean, I know why I'm here, but... Oh. Pink filter and everything. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop the music. Stop the music. Uh, I don't know if you can see, but we were a little busy at the moment. Hey, boss. Hi there, Stacy. Hope I'm not interrupting anything between you and your little friend there. I heard he was in the building. That is true. You know, I wasn't too happy with how he treated my superstars last week. About that. So our next match is a handicap match between him and the team of Matt Hardy and Batista. 
resource. I mean, I get that it's supposed to be unfair, but god damn it. Oh wow, alright, let's do this now. Okay, okay, this is easy. I just gotta whoop they ass. I'm Jim Ross, alongside Memphis' own Jerry the King Long. It's always great coming home to Memphis, JR, and I personally guarantee my hometown fans the show of a lifetime. This well, they would have gotten the show if I didn't get interrupted five seconds ago. It's gonna be an absolute slobber knocker. Up top, baby. Well, say that, JR. But considering who we've got in the ring tonight, I think you just might be right for us. Say what you will about Matt Hardy. This kid never says die. Yeah. I'll throw you again on that damn rope. We gotta knock his ass out. Now see, if I was playing this with my against my cousins or something, I'd have to fight them at the same time anyways. Because even if it was a one or two, they, if they don't get DQ'd or kicked out of the ring for you know, interfering, the game, they just JR, keep coming in. It so it wouldn't so really easy. matter. So a one or two wouldn't really be all that different. But again, if it, it's a lot more, like I said, the gameplay is a lot smoother in uh, 19 when it comes to stuff like that, which I can appreciate. Also, I didn't realize there was a thing. They the had big move animations in this game. Is almost like, because I, I reversed the net break around the point. This match is over. Go for it. I knew it was only a matter of time before he tried something like that. Hands off me. Throw ass down. Oh. Alright, new plan. I just need to get him that high in the What are they going to do next? I don't know if there's going to be anything left of these guys by the time they're done. Slightly out of range. The resiliency of these superstars is incredible. Have you ever seen superstars lay into each other the way these guys are? Rope break. All right, wait. Oh. Hello. I think I'm going to sign with SmackDown after Survivor Series and manage you. But first, I need to know that you're better than any superstar on the Raw roster. Okay. So I persuaded Eric Bischoff to make a 15-man over-the-top rope challenge between you and 14 Raw superstars. I'm sorry, what? But don't worry. They're not going to all gang up on you. There's a lot of interest in my services on this show, too. And whoever wins the match wins me. I mean, fair enough, I guess, but damn. We're going to have a cross-brand, over-the-top rope challenge this Sunday at Survivor Series for Stacy Keebler's contract. I've got to talk to Eric Bischoff right now. Maybe I can get him to make it a 16-man match. All right, here we go. Who am I exactly feeling with? Matt Hardy? Right? 
Okay, yeah, that, I gotta say. Like, he seems like the one with the axe to grind the most against me, if anything. Oh, him with that stone coal stomp. Oh, DTS like the wing. You know, his most signature of moves. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to WWE Survivor Series, the Thanksgiving tradition. Along with my broadcast partner, Taz, I'm Michael Cole, and what a spectacle this co-production of Raw and SmackDown is going to be. Fifteen superstars are going to fight it out in a Royal Rumble match. When a superstar is thrown over the top rope and lands on the outside of the ring, he's disqualified from the match. Not for nothing, I think there's going to be a lot of motivated superstars in the ring tonight. The last survivor gets, let me get this straight, special services of Stacy Keebler? Nice. Yeah, this makes it sound so much what worse. What makes say this it. match even more unprecedented is that there will be one lone SmackDown superstar in the ring against 14 superstars from Raw. If he survives, Stacy comes to SmackDown. I'll tell you what, I won't mind that one bit. I know you don't need me to remind you of how important this match is. If you want to continue our professional relationship, you've got to win tonight. <sighs> all right, let's do this. You need to outlast all those other guys because I need a man who can go all night long. Oh. And if you do win, we'll celebrate with a little party where no one's going to disturb us. Except the cameraman, because they're like fucking ninjas in this place. They're everywhere. But that's only if you win tonight. No pressure. No pressure. All right, all right, all right. Eyes on the prize. Thank God, for some reason in my mind, I remember doing a match like this at Survivor Series. Or not Survivor Series, but like for the pay-per-view for her contract. Back in the day, but in my mind, I always thought it was like a 30 man Royal Rumble. I was like, there's no way I can beat like 30 dudes. It's going to take forever. And then immediately I went, oh yeah, I picked that up too. And then at this point, I was like, oh, okay. Ladies and gentlemen, Taz and Michael Cole here at Ringside, and we have a great show for you tonight. Hey, I got top bill tonight. I like that, Cole. Keep it up. Let me ask you, Taz, when you see a matchup like this, do you wish you were still an active wrestler? Yeah, this is one of those oh. matches that I would I would kill to be a part of back in the day. No question. Yeah, HBK in there, Chris Jericho, Tajiri. I haven't got to fight these dudes yet. Because they're... Pride in the hearts of these two great competitors. Raw well, superstars, and I'll probably know. never fight them. God, I'm stupid. Oh, shit, That's A-Train's in there. Another one from the boys, the original. Oh, he, oh, he got the corner finish on. Man, the pure dad's just waiting. At least it's not like that shit in like the other games where they can hit you with finishers and knock you out the ring. Or like triple team you. That was also annoying because you basically can't really fight your way through that. Oh, shit. All right, come on. I'm good. Shawn Michaels is one of the greatest WWE. Jericho putting incredible pressure on that lower back from the world of Jericho. Really making tap. Come on, you big ass out. Boy, he's such a pain to throw out. Oh, god damn, finally. Don't mind me, don't mind me. Oh. Okay. Nah, I'm, I'm good. I'm going, baby. Gets on a lot of people's nerves, but you gotta remember that he is the very first undisputed champion. Yeah, he got some accolades. About to be the third eliminated. <sighs> Thank God this isn't 30 people, though. This would be wearing the fuck out of my fingers after like 10. <laughs> I say that as I still got to throw out a bunch do. of other people. <sighs> okay. Taken care of. Fuck you, Matt Hardy. Between and rivals, just clinging to your ass over here. Oh, 
smash, 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 smash. Mm. Yeah, sit your ass out. Tell you what, Cole, I'll handle talking about what it feels like to be in the ring. Oh, shit. You give some tips on how to force somebody's hand. Get out. No, I got it. Uh-uh. 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 Let me go. Let me go. Imagine the tension in the ring, Cole. Well, you could if you actually got in the ring. Oh boy. Chill, Kane. Thank you, Rick Flair. You know, some of these people, I'm like, personality-wise, I don't see why they would want fucking, uh... I mean, I know why they would want to, but I mean, like, why they would specifically want Tori Wuss. I, I can't even talk right now. Uh, Stacey Keebler. Like, I don't know, Triple H never seemed like the romantic type. Well, I guess this technically, she isn't romantic these people. She's romantic me, but you know what I mean. So much as a game, but I want to win. Don't think worse than Let's go. By a guy who's making funny. He did it. He won the match, and Stacy Keebler. <laughs> oh God, I hate these over the top rope matches. They're so scary. There goes a very happy superstar. Hey. Is it getting hot in here, or is, uh, is it just me? This is me, calm down. No offense, Taz, but if there's anything hot in here, it's Stacy. Hey. She's so much taller than me. It's just weird. But yeah, it's cool, though. You know, you, like, snoop off a beat kind of thing. I like that. Oh, I can't tell you how glad I am that you didn't say it was me. <laughs> They're good. Hello. Congratulations. I think this business relationship is going to work out just fine. Mm -hmm. It might be November, but I still feel like it's getting a little warm in here. So here's something that I've been promising you for a while now. Oh. Huh. Oh, yeah, we're not getting into what this time, are we? Why is my controller vibrating? <laughs> Just look at my fucking guy's face on all this.
It makes it sound like she has more layers on than she actually does. Oh. It's the weirdest thing. I can still hear the crowd for some reason. It's like they know what's happening. Because they're just chameleon like cameraman. Oh, right. The no touching rule. I, I, I forget sometimes. Success. Sexy Stacy Keebler is ready to take your business relationship to the next level. You may call on this diva to join you as your manager for certain matches throughout season mode. Select the diva option in the matchup screen when available to bring the diva to the ring. Hell yeah. Alright guys, I thank y'all for watching and I will see y'all when I see y'all. Alright? Peace.